had a former student. Yesterday, the President Provost formally approved our initiative over a year to develop to become a university wide teacher faculty disciplinary research center. They say we've been moving in this direction for a while. We have added already four professors of disciplines other than law to our steering committee. We've been taking on projects that But this completes and will intensify our turn in the interdisciplinary direction. So that raises the obvious question what should we focus on now? To what set of issues should we turn our methodological anew, expand its methodological telescopes and microscopes? We have ideas, of course, on that issue, but we're eager for more. So, selfishly, what we are most hopeful to get to is uh, thoughts of you concerning the topics that marriage examination and the ways in which this could be said to examine or to churn up, in other words, what hypotheses were the intentions of the interpreter of the internet. The format of the conference reflects that purpose. So we will limit that conference in the time we'll be talking at you. This is not to say that our discussions here will be formless. Each of the sessions will begin with a presentation of some kind designed to provoke and direct conversation. But in each of the sessions, at least half of the time will be devoted to conversation. In those conversations, I hope to address each other, not just the speakers. To encourage this, um, we're not only allocating much time that's practicable to open discussion in the plenary periods, but we've also set up a variety of electronic devices, most of which are described in detail in the packet. SL, IRC, Twitter, a question tool, and so forth, all of which are designed to encourage you to make interventions in the discussion electronically. And uh, so we'll have up here the screen display the questions that are being submitted so that the electronic discussion as well as the real discussion. Another opportunity for engagement is the food for thought dinners tonight. 